What's up everyone? Today I have a short review slash commentary on headsets. Um, sound, using sound is a big part of uh, gaming these days. And at a minimum you should be wearing a stereo headset. But uh, if you're looking for a real uh, advantage in first-person shooters I would suggest a true 5.1 headset uh, the first pair here they're just a stereo regular stereo headset Plantronics that I got from Best Buy they're alright they're just regular stereo headsets they sit actually sit on top of the ear. They don't uh, cup the ear or surround the ears. And uh, next are uh, these are true 5.1 surround sound headsets. Uh, Turtle Beach HBA twos. Um, they are a hit or miss. These headsets. Um, I find the manufacturing process to be really cheap. The solders are are ugly. They're they're huge, solid uh, silver snot balls. So I do not suggest um, getting the uh, Turtle Beach HPAs. Um, that's my second pair. I had to return the first pair because the uh sound was moving from left to right on its own not having to do anything with the video or the game and uh this uh on the second pair whenever there's bass i get an additional uh vibration sound on the left side um the return process was pretty easy, I guess, but uh, it's just a hassle. I mean, you should be able to just buy one headset and, you know, and you expect it to work. Um, I mean, I understand that in, in a batch of headsets, there can be a few bad ones, but to get two, two bad ones is, is unacceptable. And I do not recommend um, the the Turtle Beach headsets. It's just real bad manufacturing. And these third headsets are the Triton AX Pros. Um, after using these for a while, they appear to be uh, really good quality. Um, I have not looked inside and I don't, don't plan on them because they work perfectly. As compared to a, a good working um, t the Turtle Beach HPA 2, the tur Turtle Beach has a little bit more bassier uh, a base, I guess. It, it, uh, the base is a little more um, I guess lower frequency and uh, as I mentioned earlier that also there was a additional vibration because of the bass so I don't know if the two are related or um, it's it just a, a bad uh, manufacturer uh, again the, the Triton AX Pros they are a 5.1 headset they have a uh, four plugs, one for the center sub, one for front, and one for the surround, and one for the microphone. Um, the Triton AX Pros also come with a, a digital converter box, Adobe digital converter box. Um, I would have preferred to have used that with the uh, optical, but uh, my sound card, and most sound cards, uh, after doing some research, only put out uh, stereo through the optical. So um, I'm talking to the PC gamers. 
if you uh, decide to get a, a high-end uh, pair of headphones, I would suggest the Tritons, but don't get the AX Pro. Get the uh, just the analog 5.1 ones. I think they're called the AX 720s or something like that. So uh, basically, th the commentary is uh, definitely use he headsets no matter what. But if you want to spend some more money, get a true 5.1 headset. It really does make a difference on uh, accuracy of the sound of of the where the sound is coming from around you. Uh, I don't suggest the Turtle Beach HPA twos because of the poor quality in manufacture. I've had to return. Um, one and the, and the second one is also bad and I'll probably end up returning them since I have another decent pair of headsets I can use. Um, and uh, I, s I really suggest the the Triton uh, AX series, the, f the 5.1 surround. Uh, the, the base on the trains is not as loud as the uh, Turtle Beach, but the uh, sound quality and accuracy is awesome. So, thanks for watching this video.